Hi, Mary from Reviewer's Diary, and I am here with my Ipsy bag. Oh my gosh, I love this. Um, I was very happy and impressed when I got this bag. Of course, I don't wait. I just can't wait. So, anyway, here is the theme. Hot Summer Nights. And... This is the card. Doesn't have a whole lot of stuff on it, like um, tagging people and doing all kinds of other stuff. And here is the bag. Bag oh! Oh my goodness, it's like duochrome kind of silvery bag. It's really, really pretty. And I guess these are beach umbrella tops. So, yeah, it's kind of an iridescent silver. What I pull out first is this cream, and this is a, it looks like a night cream. Now I've been nursing along the same night cream for a while, and believe me, one fluid ounce of this will last forever. I do still have to look this up and see if Be Fine is cruelty free, because I'm not absolutely positively positive. If it's not cruelty free then I will trade it. Just like every other stinking dang blasted not cruelty free thing I've gotten. Okay now I haven't even looked at the color of this but I got another Trust Fund Beauty Nail Polish. Now Trust Fund is cruelty free. I'll tell you how you get mostly cruelty free stuff on and this is called No Filter on Ipsy. It all comes down to writing your reviews. Now what I do is I write reviews, stuff that I that's not cruelty free, I will act, absolutely make it positively known that I don't like the brand. Even if I like the brand, I say I don't like it just so they stop giving it to me. So for example, this could be really beautiful, wonderful cream, but if it's not cruelty free, I'm not going to use it and I'm going to give it bad marks on Ipsy. They really do pay attention to the reviews that you write. Now here is the Trust Fund Nail Polish. And this is just a beautiful, like pale, it's kind of like a pale pinky color that is perfect for the summer. So yeah, that's really cool. I really like that. I'm like running out of room though for nail polish. I have so many nail polishes. Hmm. Okay, next thing is all wrapped up and in bubble wrap. Oops. Um, this is another brand I have to look up. Oh, do I see a bunny? I'm not sure if I see a bunny. It's completely wrapped in plastic and I'm reluctant until I know for sure that it's cruelty free to open it. Like I've said in other videos, once you've swatched something, it's considered used. So yeah, and the plastic goes all the way around the edge here. So this is Mellow brand. Let's see if this has anything on it. Oh, there it is, bunny. No animal testing right there. Yeah, so it's got no animal testing. I still look things up even when they say no animal testing because I'm just dying to get the next thing out which is this Hangover RX. <laughs> now I do have a large size tube of this but I am going to hold on to this and use it as my travel size. I love this stuff. It's awesome. <laughs> and of course Too Faced is cruelty free. Like You can't get much better. And there is another thing in here and it is a pencil from model launcher let's see it's also completely wrapped in plastic and i'm not going to unwrap it until i know whether it's cruelty free or not because i will trade this if it's not i th want to say that i looked this one up and that it was so this is a fabulous bag and like really fabulous stuff. So I'm just gonna quickly read some stuff on here. 
I'll start with the last thing I pulled out, which is a model launcher. It's made in China, uh, marketed out of Florida, felt tip and emerald isle. Oh God. So it's a nice green color. Crap. Well, I'll look it up. Please remember also, something made in China is not automatically not cruelty free. If it's made in the People's Republic of China, like just about everything we buy in this country, it doesn't mean that it's not cruelty free because China does not require animal testing any longer thanks to the protesters who live over in China. Wonderful people walked around with bunny ears on their heads. Um, and really, really worked hard to get that changed, and it was changed. And so things that are manufactured in China are not um, necessarily, they're not automatically not cruelty free. So I'm gonna look this up and I'll let you know. Next, the Trust Fund nail polish is in a color called No Filter. And there's the color again. It's like a really pretty summer, like pinkish, off whitish color. So that'll be really pretty on. Then, of course, there's this Hangover RX primer. I really like this stuff. So, this is really good. And of course, toothpaste cruelty free. This mellow, um, I do have to put my glasses on so I can tell you exactly what this is, whether it's eyeshadow or bronzer. Uh, let's see. Well, it's an eyeshadow in some a color called baked cocoa. I can really see my lights, um, which is not usual, but I guess the wrapper is is probably reflecting. Um, it's got this plastic wrapper on it. The label says that it's cruelty free and I will look it up and make sure. So that's nice. And this is another thing I have to look up. If this is cruelty free, I'm going to probably love using this. I'm currently using um, a face cream that is from a company called Lather that I got in an Ipsy bag and it's taking like forever for that ounce to be done because really if you put more than a pea-sized amount on before bed you feel like a grease ball so um <laughs> sometimes these little sizes last forever so i'll look this up and i'll let you know so i really love this bag it's got a ton of stuff all good and you know it's very very i'm very excited about it so i will let you know um below everything like you know I do during the video I usually put whether something's cruelty free or not and if it's cruelty free it will it will stay so and it could very well be that everything in this bag is cruelty free because that's what's been happening with me and Ipsy lately I've just been getting lucky so thank you for watching this has been Mary with another fabulous Ipsy bag if you haven't subscribed yet it's ten dollars a month I do have a referral code down below I think you get points and I get points if you use my referral code. If you don't want to do that, you can just Google Ipsy and easily find their website. But of course, it would help me out a little bit to get some extra points if you decide to use my link. And you don't have to. Absolutely don't have to. So thank you for watching. This has been Mary with Reviewer's Diary. And look, it looks different colors every which way I turn it. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Have a beautiful evening. Good night.